Hey guys, welcome to Real Men Get It Done. If you're new to our channel, please like, subscribe, share, hit the notification button, all that good stuff. So you can be tuned in to everything that we do. Well, this morning we are in Houston, Texas, and we are getting up early to try to go to one of the famous breakfast spots, soul food spots, the Breakfast Club. So we heard it's, it's a worth the wait. There's always lines out the door. So trying to get up early to beat a little bit of the rush and um, check it out. See how good it is. So tune in, should be fun. Real men get it down. We are here at the world famous Breakfast Club in Houston, Texas. Uh, luckily we've heard the lines are always crazy and packed out the door, but we're visiting obviously during the pandemic. Uh, so the lines are uh, not in existence, which is so cool, which means we hopefully get a chance to get right up, get a seat and see what all of the awesomeness is about. So tune in The Breakfast Club, Houston, Texas, real men get it done. Um, can we do uh, two chicken and waffles? Yeah. And then, um, I'm sorry, I'll do the catfish. I forgot the other one. Um, let's do a catfish and catfish only come catfish and grits. Oh, uh, let's do potatoes. Toast. What would you like to drink? Let's do one lemonade, um, one fountain drink, and one sweet tea. Where do we go? What? What? Okay, so we got in, um, food came within 10 minutes, which was awesome. We were one of the first sets of people in line. They have a nice, easy, quick assembly line due to COVID, um, and we're in. We're here eating. Uh, I have uh, catfish, potatoes, and grits. My kids got chicken and waffles. We're going to share it. 
Um, but we are excited to eat. So let's get down. So as I just was explaining, the catfish was seasoned very well. Um, it was it was a lighter batter on it, which was good. Sometimes catfish can have a heavier uh, kind of batter on it. So it was very light and delicate, which made it really good. Everything else was really basic though. Nothing special really about the potatoes, nothing special about the grits, nothing special about the toast. It was just the catfish. So um, if you were to order catfish and grits, again, typical but maybe order a different side uh, outside of the potatoes. Good, it was good overall, but again, nothing overly special about the potatoes. They weren't um, extra seasoned or anything. They had a few peppers in them, but nothing um, over the top too flavorful. Uh, but the catfish was really seasoned and had a really good balance to it. So what does it taste like, baby? Um, it tastes like crawfish. It tastes like crawfish and hot sauce. See, it like they like you know how they put seasoning on crawfish. Mm -hmm. I like they put that on here with like hot sauce. Is it good? Yeah. Is it spicy? No. Not, not too spicy. No. No, it's spicy. It's just like mm -hmm. taste good. It's not that spicy. It's not spicy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You might taste it. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let me break down what we were trying to describe 
with the, the chicken and waffles. Waffle, definitely a very delicate, soft waffle. Actually, was really good. My daughter loved it. In terms of the chicken, it really was seasoned very well in terms of um, the meteor uh, drum uh, that we ate. Uh, the flats that were part of there, the wing, they weren't as flavorful. So it was weird, but the, the drum uh, was extremely flavorful. So we definitely had a good uh, time at the restaurant, the chicken and waffles. Again, the, the catfish was definitely good. Definitely uh, encourage you to go if you are there in Houston to visit. Uh, they have all of these awards for a number of reasons. And uh, one of Houston's famous rappers, Bun B, it's one of his favorite restaurants. So if you get a chance, go and check out The Breakfast Club in Houston, Texas. And that's about it for now. So till next time, real men get it done. Peace and blessings.